Hi, my name is Ahmed Ed Kilani, and welcome to my course Applying the Lambda Architecture with Spark, Kafka, and Cassandra. We see big data discussed every day, whether you're in the field actively working on big data projects, hear about the scale of problems companies like LinkedIn, Facebook, and Twitter have to deal with on a daily basis, or simply listening to the radio about some initiative where big data enabled the analysis and discovery of new insights into the data we have. In this course, our focus will be on building real-time systems that can handle real-time data at scale with robustness and fault tolerance as first-class citizens using tools like Apache Spark, Kafka, Cassandra, and Hadoop. We'll look at how thoughtful design of your big data applications allows you to combine low latency streaming data and batch workloads. We'll design and build an application from scratch using Apache Spark, Spark Data Frames, and Spark SQL, in addition to Spark's Data Sources API to load, store, and manipulate data. We'll also look at Spark streaming and Spark Kafka integration techniques for reliability and speed. We'll also write a Kafka data producer to simulate our real-time data stream feed into our streaming application. And as we dive deeper into the course, we'll look at how you can preserve global state and use memory efficiently with approximate algorithms as we build a stateful Spark streaming application. And a production application isn't complete without the ability to handle errors and code updates. We'll also learn how to use a scalable NoSQL database and persist your data to Cassandra and HDFS. By the end of this course, you'll feel comfortable building your own fault-tolerant, scalable, real-time big data systems and act on streaming and batch data with Spark, Kafka, Cassandra, and HDFS as the backbone for the Lambda architecture. Before we begin this course, you should be familiar with some programming language, preferably Java, Scala, or c -sharp, but you certainly don't have to be a master in any of these as we'll walk you through a gentle introduction to get you going. I look forward to you joining me in this journey to learn about Lambda architectures with the Applying the Lambda Architecture with Spark, Kafka, and Cassandra course at Pluralsight.